Hi, I'm Richard Reams. And I'm Candy Lynn. And we're the producers of Create the Comedy. And we're outside our production offices. This is our last day of shooting, so we're really excited. Not that it's over, but that it'll be done soon. We're about to shoot the bathtub scene. Yeah. And uh, we thought it'd be cool to take you on a tour of some of the locations we shot at. So let's go. So this is the hallway where we shot part of the anger scene, which you will see if you see the movie. And then this was Clementine's apartment, apartment 29. And now we can go to where we shot the coffee shop scene. So this is where we shot the cafe scene. We built had all these tables and plants brought in and a bunch of really cool extras that happened to be our neighbors. And what you, what's really cool about this location is that's Clementine's apartment up there. So everything was in walking distance. And our production offices are right over here. So, so this is the infamous house of Clementine's ex-boyfriend. And now we're going to go finish the movie. How about that? Let's go. Let's go. So here we are at the set of the bathroom scene. And Cantu Lentz, our star, is also working in his art department right now, helping dress this. Milagro is here somewhere. He's our star cat. He's actually got uh, the second largest part in the film. But I don't know where he is. Hey, where's the cat? Oh, there he is. He's already on the set. He's in the green room. See, the wall's green. That's Milagro. Now, we won't tell you what's going on in this scene, because then why would you want to see a movie? But it involves bubbles, a bath, and Clementine. Not as sexy as it sounds. Hi, we're back. We just finished shooting the bathtub scene, and you did great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No, thank you. No, no. No, thank, thank you. you. All right. Uh, okay. Anyway, uh, let's start that over. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> okay, well, let's not start it over. We're going to stick with this. Yeah. All right, I well, I, cool. all right, that's cool. cool. All right, anyway, so Grief of Comedy is about a young woman, Clementine, smart, beautiful, sensible, and she walks in on her boyfriend, cheating on her. And that's really where the movie begins, after that. Not cool under any circumstances to walk in on that. So the movie is about Clementine dealing with this loss, so to say, and all the crazy things she does in order to get over her ex-boyfriend and I mean I I don't like saying crazy just because within that within the moment it's it's not crazy it's the way you chose to deal with what you were going through I mean from the outside it looks crazy sure but um but it's a fun little short film we put together yeah it was certainly fun putting it together and we're very proud of it and we hope you guys enjoy it too um so thank, thank you, you. How it all started. We're neighbors. We met about a year ago. Uh, I was coming home and Cantu saw me opening my gate and ran up to me. She needed to shoot an audition video and she asked if I could immediately do that for her. So she came over and she blew me away. She did this like right there in the spot. She was doing an audition, not for anything I was doing. And I immediately saw the incredible camera presence and talent and watchability that this young super future star uh, has. Thank you, Richard. That is so nice. Thank you. No, it's just a fact. Well, Richard helped me out because I was, I didn't know how to shoot my audition. I was trying to put my camera on like books. It was a mess. So he helped me shoot a great audition. And then he showed me his reel, which blew me off my feet. Not sure if that's a thing one says. But it is now. Thanks. I mean, <laughs> I mean, this guy is pretty damn cool. You should check out his reel. Anyways. From director Richard Reams, starring Cantu Lentz, a guy cheating on her is unthinkable, or so she thought. Ricky, are you ready? You never get your tie right. Come over here. <laughs> We all do crazy things when our hearts get broken. I can do ties. 
Grief, a comedy. When insanity is the only way back to sanity.